When processing a sale at your place of business, a transaction goes through a few stages before hitting your bank. In order for a sale to get deposited into your bank account, you need to close the batch on your terminal. The sale will remain in a form of an approved authorization code in your POS terminal until you cash out or settle the batch. Every time you process a credit card sale, a transaction gets assigned to a specific category with a corresponding rate. For example, a simple consumer card transaction with no reward program, processed via a chip reader and set within 24 hours will most probably end up in a lower rate category. If the transaction meets all other requirements but isn't settled within 24 hours, it'll be downgraded and you'll pay a higher rate. Why? Because the longer an authorization code sits in an open batch, the higher the risk. Another factor is the authorization code expiry. MasterCard authorizations, for example, expire in seven days. So if the batch isn't settled by then, the authorization code sitting in your terminal in the open batch becomes invalid. If you settle the batch with expired authorization codes, the cardholders will be able to win the case should they decide to file a chargeback with the issuing bank. Our terminals have the option to settle the batch automatically. We strongly recommend you use this function on your POS device to avoid downgrades and other issues.